I will assume that you clicked on this video to know how to download the Dragonfire client for Mindtest. I had already made a video about this two years ago and yeah the video is pretty old but it works but there has been a lot of confusion lately and I've been getting some comments regarding problems about it. So I'm, go I'm just gonna show you again how to do it. So basically I will provide you a link in the description. What you need to do is click on that and get into this github page. This is a page of the developer who made it. From here you can download the 32 build or 64 build as per your PC build. Mine is 64 bit PC so I will download the Dragonfire client 64 bit. Wait for it to download. Now once it's downloaded your work is done. What you need to do is unzip the file like I'm doing here. Basically just unzip it, go into it, go to bean folder and run the mindtest.exe and that should pretty much work. Now my PC is a little slow and it's loading it. So ignore that. Yeah, so it's done loading. Just double click and run it and there you go. That's your Jagger Fire client or your cheat client for mind test. One thing which I would recommend you to do is go to settings and change the size of the cheat menu. This is because the cheat menu height and size is too large and it doesn't fit the screen of many people. So what you can do is go there and uh, decrease the sizes to its half like it's set here 200. I have reduced it to 100 the head height I have reduced to 50 to 25 and the entry height to 40 to 20 what this basically does is decreases the size of the cheat menu nothing else now you can join any server but be careful because lots of servers uh, identify as dragonfire client so you can get banned so use it at your own risk I'm playing a develop test world to show you that it actually works yeah so i have entered a world it is single player and on the top left corner you can see the cheat menu basically it and lots of people say that uh, uh, they can't interact with the cheat menu what you need to do is press the arrow keys on your keyboard the one on the right side of your hand those arrow keys are used to interact with the cheat menu and press enter to enable the cheat if you want to know what each cheat does, I have already made a few tutorials on the basics of them. And other ones you can pretty much uh, find it on your own because the names are self-explanatory. Thank you for watching the video.